Hi, I'm Professor Ian McLaughlin. I'm going to tell you a little bit about some of my speech research firsts. It began with my PhD, which ended in 1997, and this led to a patent on a system to improve speech intelligibility of speech that's replayed into a noisy environment. And this was used in radios for the police and other public services. In 1999, I created the world's first Mandarin Chinese speech intelligibility assessment system. This is a system able to identify how good that speech, or how intelligible it is, um, to a human listener. 2006, my PhD students and I created the Bionic Voice Project. And this is a project that's aiming to give the power of speech back to patients who've experienced voice loss, for example, through a laryngectomy. 2008, we discovered something called super audible speech and that is using ultrasound, that sound which is above the threshold of human hearing, so high frequency you can't hear it, and that's reflected off the human face to identify when somebody's speaking and identify what they're saying. I then moved on to machine hearing in 2015, publishing the first papers that used deep learning and then CNNs, convolutional neural networks, for the task of machine hearing. Machine hearing is giving computers the ability to listen to sounds and understand what they represent. In 2018, I worked with Olivia Paratam on GFM IAF. We use this for voice modification, so we can take somebody's speech and modify it in many naturalistic, good quality ways. Since then, I've done a lot of AI for speech. I've applied it to so many areas, from speech recognition, machine hearing, language identification, dialogue identification, speech intelligibility enhancement, and even some niche areas, for example, analysing the sound from lungs during auscultation to identify whether somebody is suffering from a disease. There's lots of applications. Speech and audio is absolutely fascinating. I'm just waiting to discover more things.